Welcome to the shooting range minigame. I'm going to quickly explain the rules and we'll hop into it fairly quickly. Basically, the way this will work is there will be a set number of these little guys. Balloons that will appear on the various rows in front of you. There's the first row, the second row, and furthest away from you is this kind of top back row. These balloons will, as time goes on, reveal to be both a number and a color. Oh, yeah, I have the other. I remember how I set this up. Boop. Basically... Some will be yellow, some will be blue, and, well, of course, some will be red. The numbers and the colors is what you have to watch and look out for as you roll and play this game. This is a game that I designed to, well, be fair to everyone. None of your gifts can apply to the bonuses or anything that you have in this minigame. This minigame works like this. There's three levels of reveal. The first row will be revealed first of what number and color it is. The second row will be revealed second. And, of course, the third row will be revealed last. The number and what your goal is, is why you are rolling to die during this, is to select color, a either a color or a number and go for that specifically to gain points in this. Basically... At the beginning of every round, you will roll to die. Select a color, red, green, whatever. Um, and then you will proceed to keep that color, and you can keep that color as long as you like, going up the further rows. The first row revealed, you will roll to die. First roll reveal, you can choose the roll to die again. Second row is revealed, you can choose... Uh, to roll to die once more, and then the third uh, the third row is revealed. It's very hard to get matching of things on the third row because you don't get to re-roll for this. We will do three rounds of this, which forms a set. Um, so every round they are revealed. Once we add up the points for that uh, that specific set, we will do three sets. If that makes sense. Um, so we will do three three times of revealing all the balloons and counting up points to see who's in the lead. Uh, basically, if you have the color, you are able to pop it with your 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 uh, dart. If you have the number, you are able to pop it with your dart. If you have bo both, the points are doubled for popping that specific balloon. Row one nets you one point, um, which it will be doubled to two if you have matching of both. Row two will have... Uh, will be two points, four for both. The last row is three points, six for both. However, during this, for the entire match, you have two abilities you can activate. Or for the entire round, you have two abilities that you can activate um, for the entirety of this. Once you use it, you don't get it back. You have two, which allows you to change the number to whatever you want. And a second one, which allows you to change the color. So freely to whatever you you decide to be it so if you're like you have a three and you're matching the three at the top this is the way that you can kind of manipulate the system at the end to grab some of the ones at the very end but that is that is just the case here so instead of rolling to do at the beginning or at the end at any point you can use these two abilities to switch uh your stuff but you cannot roll to die for that round so if you hit the third one and you know you're going to use your change it swap a color you could hold off your roll to die Wait until they're revealed and change the color to match them. Um, but if you use that in the first round, you do not have the ability to use it in the second one. Um, so fairly simple. It's just about matching colors and numbers and rolling the dice and hoping it's in your favor. Um, you can also swap, uh, swap your swing before you roll the die. If, for say, you have a red three and you're trying to get a red four, you can drop it and then roll to die just to do it. But you can also roll to die 
holding on that to that color number to see if you can get a different color or number up to you uh is there any questions regarding that so um just want to make sure i got this right we can only roll to die once per round and only roll to do or is it the other way around uh there's no rolls to do in this uh you can only roll to die uh you roll to die before every reveal oh okay yeah um, so if there's three balloons here, you roll to die, select whatever dice you want, the balloons are revealed, and then you roll to die before the next stage, and so on. Um, you have the two triggered abilities that you can activate for the entirety of the match set, which is change the color freely and change the number freely. Um, so you can pop those early, or you could hold them out, it's whatever you really want to do here. Um. All right. Are we good to start this i believe yep. so um okay mm -hmm. i will have to quickly roll for each of the balloons so give me one second okay All right, let me place this out. This is the one thing that takes a little time on my end to figure out. But... Uh, as you are doing this, the little box man has scotch tape that he is coming, and you see him quickly, like, jump up, taping the balloons to the little bars as they go back. And you can see him struggling for the last one, but he always eventually gets it. Do you guys prefer sticking to this song, or would you rather go back to the goofy Lear music? Uh, I'm good either way. Was that Thrash? I'm good either way. Okay. We'll go back to goofy Lear music. Where did I stick this? There you go. This is just feels like a mini game song. All right. So as it takes a few minutes for the good old uh, Digimon to tape all the balloons up, he kind of pops his head up over the little the the little bar in front of you and just you're good to go. So. Everybody, roll to die for the round one. Oh, Ben, you can go ahead and... I don't... Why is your yellow... Why is your sheet bugged out? <laughs> oh, you got wounded earlier. For those who are yeah. wounded, go ahead and unwound it for the duration of this minigame so you can do it properly. Right. And then you can re-roll by... Or, Ben. Alright. We'll just have to remember to ruin those after. I, I magically healed... It's a miracle. It's the power of mini games. All right, everybody has selected, so I will slowly reveal the balloons. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah, there's a four red in the first bar. There is...
There we go. All right. You can choose to keep your swing and still roll to die, or you can drop it before rolling to die. But remember, if you roll to die, you cannot use one of your two special abilities. All right. You guys rolling to die or what? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Is that what you guys are locking in going into the next round? Yes. Junsei, you got very lucky with your, your first. <laughs> I did, yes. All right. This is technically about not just kept the same swings as before. <laughs> yeah. Red's, Red's Ben's favorite color. It's... It's very RNG, but like at the same time, you can aim for a color is the, the nice thing of this, is you're always guaranteed to get a certain amount of points. Um, the first one is a yellow two. The next one is a another blue three. And then the last one is a yellow two. Uh, yeah, I, I think I have a... I think I'm keeping the swing. Look at that six, seven points that you have on the field right now. <laughs> nice. All right. Do remember that if you choose not to roll to die here, you can use one of your two abilities after um, after these last balloons are revealed if you want to be able to switch um, to that. But Jensei, I don't, I don't know what the point of you rolling is. <laughs> you know? You don't, if you decide not to roll the die, you don't have to use your point. It's up to you how many times you want to roll the die, but. I mean, I'll still roll. But... All right. I, I don't think I'll be switching out of this blue three. The power of RNG. Jesus. Uh, anyone else rolling to die, or are you just going to wait until the last reveal? I think I'll wait. Okay. Damn. All right. To come with the last one, we have a red three. Ooh. We have a red four. And we have a blue two. Dang it. So close yet, so far. Uh, so you said it might be, like, possible to, like, switch colors if we wanted to? Yes, you have a one-use ability for the set to switch your color to whatever color you like. Uh, and then the other one is for the number? And for the number. So you can switch your yellow to be, like, a yellow two if you want. Uh, but you only have one use of that ability, so if, you, if that's something you want to hold off on, you can. I'll switch to a red four. Okay. So you decided to use your change in number? Yeah, I think I'll change to two. Okay. What about you, Sheep? You can't use it because I you rolled the I'm die, <laughs> but... Yeah, I think I'm good. All right. Uh, if you... Basically, this is how this works. Row one is worth one point. Row one is worth two points. Row three is worth three points. If you got either the color or the number, you get the uh, point value. If you happen to get both, that point value is doubled. 
Um, so feel free to calculate yours. I will try to keep it written somewhere for myself to know. Um, one, three, four, first row. Ten points, June say. Wow. Uh, isn't it fourteen? Um, because I got four points on the first row, four points on the second row, and then six. You would get, you would get three points. No, 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 no. Because you I didn't match some of those double. colors. The points double if you have both the number and the color. Yeah, and I have a blue three, so they double on the one of the middle. So the first one, the five would be one point for you. The three on the first row would be two points. And then four for the middle one, because they're worth two points each for both matching. It's two points base. You doubled it because you have both the color in that. And the last one is worth three. Well, yes, but do my threes not count for the red and the yellow ones? Oh, shoot, you're right. I don't know why I was just forgetting about that. <laughs> you are correct. Yeah, that's, that's how I got to 14. Okay. First round complete. Ooh. Go ahead and drop your colors for me. Zach, you good in there, bro? I hear him coughing in the distance. I'll live. Good to hear. I sure hope. You're an important part of the plot. Nah, we'll remove Byron. It's fine. We don't need him. Byron. Who is Byron? I do think it would have been funny, though, if someone couldn't make the Christmas episode and the bit is they just don't exist in that universe. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Ah, oh, yeah, Ben, you're an only child, right? Yeah. Yep. Always have been. Well, no, he has a sister. So, he just doesn't have a younger brother. <laughs> that poor sister got nuked out of existence in this Christmas special, special for no apparent reason. <laughs> he's the only child and he's spoiled because of it. He'd probably be a very different character, that's for sure. <laughs> you typically play characters that are only children. At least from my experience <laughs> with you being my player. Yeah. Anywho, go ahead and roll to die for me, guys. All right. First balloon is a yellow two. Second balloon is a red four. Blue one. And then finally for row one, it is a red three. Go 
Go ahead and perform whatever action you want. If you want to drop and re-roll entirely, you can. Or just roll the die normally. Bless you. Thank you. Um, all right. Time to reveal the second row. I don't understand my brain sometimes because I'll straight up try to use my mouse on my computer to scroll over to my laptop for no reason at all. It doesn't work like that. Not because it's, it's just, you just get that urge that you can totally do it. And then it just doesn't work. You're like, but why? Oh my god. <laughs> Hello, RNG. Yellow 2 is the place to be. Yeah. Is that what you have? No, Ben, you have a no, 4. I have a yellow f I have a 4. You still have your number changed, though. I do. I want to... Um... I think I switched it to yellow 2 last time, and I'm like, come on. There we go. <laughs> gonna keep my stuff okay yeah i'm gonna wait for the last round <laughs> yeah i'll wait and see this time all right the last reveal is a blue six Ooh. and another blue six oh all right this paid off oh man <laughs> damn you played, yeah you, you got... played the long game yeah, you yep. got bad points on this one. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. Uh, yeah. All right, activate any of the abilities that you would like to do here. Um, I'm going to keep this. <laughs> I'm going to change to a yellow two, I think. Uh, okay. Would changing my color or number help me in this one? I think you would have to change, like, both to really. <laughs> no, if I just change one, I could still get a good amount. Yeah, I'm going to change it so that instead I am a red two. Okay. That way I pick up all the lovely twos on the map. Yeah, all right. Time to calculate is... In reality, all you guys are rapidly throwing darts as this poor little box man is just jumping up and replacing them as fast as he can. That would put you at 23. Yeah. Okay. I believe I did math correctly. <laughs> okay, uh, Saburo or Thrash, uh, did you, did either of you use your, like, second ability? I don't, no. okay. No, I, I only used my first color. one. Alright, just making sure I, like, did not forget, uh. Go ahead and drop as I reset the balloons. <laughs> it's actually very close, hilariously. Oh my god, mm -hmm. how many balloons are you making? 
into the jeep layer. <laughs> How many did I make? Because I think I counted incorrectly when I was making these balloons. <laughs> Uh oh I made I made the normal amount. Oops. Ignore that. <laughs> <laughs> it's a oh, blue two! <laughs> but how does one roll one D balloons? <laughs> it's it's perfectly spherical, so it just it's just infinite. Infinite balloon. All right. Welcome to the money round. Go ahead and roll to die for me. managed to go through all three colors have a very weird spread of oh that's funny okay <laughs> all right so the first one is a one the second one is a two and the third one can you guess what the third one is a, a one a three oh my God. last holy off moly. holy moly <laughs> uh hold on i'm gonna go cough up a lung as you guys use your abilities or roll the die again and get that situated so i'll be right back yeah uh what was our second ability anyway i totally uh change color oh i did that so i can only change my number now okay Keep it red for now. Or rather, I'll roll to food. Hmm. Keep mine. Right, no, I did change my number, not my color. So I can change my color if I want, but not my number. Think I'll hold this for the moment. Yeah, same. Well, I got, it's hard to get a good read on it right now. That final row is just going to be like, oh, all the points or none of them. Mm -hmm. At least fulfilled my main goal, which is getting all the colors. Yes. Paint with all the colors of the wind. Yes. That's coming out of his eyes. I sure hope this shows up on the recording. <laughs> it probably won't. Oh, if only it did. Yeah. It will if we continue doing it to the next round. True. Comes back. Don't tell him, don't tell him. <laughs> It'll be our secret. secret plot <laughs> what if we just took all the darts and just pop them at once
Don't tell me what. What have you guys done? Nothing. I Nothing. leave you for a few minutes and you do something. <laughs> you haven't done anything. Mm -hmm. Alright, yeah, you guys good for round two? Yeah. We hope we all rolled. Okay. Oh god. Ah, uh, brain. Um blue five. Ooh. Uh one and then another two. Ooh. Alrighty. I shall hold. Same. As will I. I figured that was the case, so you guys can use all your abilities. Yes, we're all in. See. Alright, the first one is a blue one. The second one is a red five. Ooh. Then we have a blue three. And then finally, to finish this off, a red four. I want to analyze all these points. Good. If I do nothing real quick. This is where I was saying we have a weird number spread. Yeah, I can only change my color, and I don't really think that's going to help me since I have to hold on to two. Yeah, there's there's only that red two in the first row. And I can yeah. only change my color since I'm a six. The best I can do is change to blue so that I can get the top, middle, and bottom row a little bit, yeah. Yeah, I like this color as well. But you're already like a blue three so would you want to change color? i i no, think yeah no. i think he has the most optimized the most optimal point i think would be having a blue one in reality but yeah but eh, beggars can't be choosers right now all right Bad. with activating your abilities calculate those final scores and send it to me in dm so we have a surprise of who gets it because it's kind of funny to look at it because, like, each of you has had a really good round. So, I don't know. It's a very close ball game right now. You can also use slash GM or whatnot for the GM thing. I just sent it to you in Discord. Okay. Same. Wait, I miscalculated on something. What's her never been? Three? Uh, round three. So blue. No, like your blue is... Yeah, blue three. Blue, yeah, three. blue three. So that means... Now I'm messing myself up. I quickly calculated your total for this round. I do not know your total. Uh, you were. Uh, that's what I got. Oh. I'm uh, just gonna double check everything. Ah, wait, no, I miscounted. I think I know who wins, but goodness. That actually got really what? close. Does that sound right for you, Thrash? Yes. I okay. Got, uh, here, I got total. Which means... Total. It... Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. Are you recounting, Chief? I math. Huh? Are you recounting? Because you said you miscalculated. Oh, no. I was counting everyone's. Don't worry about it. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. You guys ready? Because this is somehow extremely close. Interesting. All right. Yeah. Like, it's, it's For fast. last place, Junsei coming in at 34. Really? Yeah. I, I got awful on the last round, unfortunately. True. In second place with 35 is Saburo, and in first place <laughs> yes! is 36 with Thrash, so... <laughs> Yeah, what like, is... these are extremely <laughs> close. I won! Are you proud of yourself? <laughs> I am, I am. <laughs>